Hi, Cute Critters 19 here, and today I actually have a Pets at Home haul. I have a quite a few hauls coming recently because I just ordered from Viva, which should be here next week, and I probably have a collective haul and another few in December, so there's quite a few things I'm ordering at the minute. But anyway, I'll just get into this haul. I only spent £20, so there's not that much here. But first of all, I needed to just top up on supplies, so I just got the medium pet safe bedding, and this is obviously the paper one, which is yes, 350 grams, and this is only three pounds, and this is the one I get now, obviously, because we're all to stop selling theirs. So this is the only decent one I can find at the minute, but he does seem to like that, so just needed to top up on that. And then the last supply I needed to get was obviously Supreme Harry Hamster because he has like pretty much none left. He has a little bit left so I need to put this in soon. And this is just £2 in pets at home. And he, this is pretty much his main food anyway. Then I just got basically treats because he I don't really have that much. So first of all I got seed treats which in my store they're three for two but they don't show up online so they not, might not be every store. So they're three for five pound and I got the rabbit popcorn sticks which are completely fine pounces as well. And then I got the hamster fruit sticks which I will only be giving to my new hamster next month because Joey doesn't actually like the fruit ones. And then I just got the hamster honey sticks. So I got them. Then I got the Pets at Home apple strudel biscuits which just look like that. And these are £2. I've been wanting to try these for absolutely ages but for some reason never got around to getting them. So hopefully you should like them. Put them there. Then another thing I've been wanting to try for ages, but I didn't think I could actually get anywhere. Well, I can't. I can only seem to get the rotor stack ones in Arg Argos. As do I always do that. But these are just the short egg biscuits with wild berries. Nutritious and tasty treats from animals. Uh, I probably wouldn't say they're suitable for rabbits and guinea pigs though because obviously they've got egg in which kind of gives it away yeah so I definitely would only give them to like gerbils rats I think and mice certainly not rabbits guinea pigs and chinchillas because of the egg content but they were two pound then I think this is the last treat I got, it's just the Wild Berry Drops Pets at Home range. These are £2 and they're just a 75 gram receivable bag. He's had these before, I think these are the only ones he's had apart from yogurt, choc yogurt and chocolate drops. And they do again say they're suitable for rabbits and guinea pigs, but they're not because they've got milk in. Yeah, they've got milk in, so don't give them, just give them to rats, mice and hamsters, and maybe gerbils, but I'd say they're a bit high in sugar for gerbils. So they were just £2. And then, I got one last Christmas thing, because I have got pretty much all of his Christmas presents now, apart from, I've got to make an online order. But I just got these, there's no name for them, but they're just like little play balls. They look a bit like the ones from Chinchillas to shop. And these are just £2 for the three. And I don't know at all if he's actually going to play with these. Because he doesn't like this sort of thing. But I got them anyway. Because there's not much, surprisingly enough, there's not much left in my store. For the Christmas range, it's been like pretty much emptied already and it's it was in the first of November when I went. So there's really not a lot left already. 
then the last two toys I got are actually for my new hamster which I'm not getting until the end of December or the start of January because i got to get the cage first in December and that's when I next get any money so I first got the stick and ball shoe it used to be the stick and nut shoe and as you can see it's just sticks with I have no idea what material that is but it's the same as those balls there with a the ball in the middle and this is fine for all small animals and this was £3 Joey did have one of these but he doesn't play with any sort of like wood, to uh, wood toys because he doesn't chew them at all so hopefully the new house still will chew up there then I just got the Woodland Small Ball Rush Ball and it's just a little ball which this is only a pound and this is the New Hampshire as well so hopefully he will chew that. I haven't got many toys for New Hampshire yet so they will go away for him. And that is it for my haul. Look out for my VFET haul next week and I will have some non-haul videos up soon as well. See you in the next video, bye.